Good morning from Sydney, Australia. Good morning, Kyle. Good morning. <laughs> Where are we going today? Going to Manly Beach. Where is Manly Beach? Across the harbor. Across the harbor. How far from our home? Ooh, it's probably going to be maybe a half an hour to get there, I think, this morning. Half an hour walking? Well, we have to take the train first. Ah, okay. And then we have to take the ferry over, and then we'll get there. So, a bit of a journey. So, let's go. Let's go to the beach, itch. So this is the metro station that we take every day when we go out of the hotel. We pass by these little stores and we take two steps of stairs to go down. Here's the entrance, so we tap our card over here and set tap success. Funny thing that we have to tap again when we leave the station. We didn't know. Now we go down one more level. So in fact, three levels of stairs. Here we are on the station where we always wait for the train. Our train's about seven minutes to arrive. Usually we like to stay in the top level because we can see outside better. And I always choose the seats that we can go front or back. This way depends on the position of the train. I don't feel dizzy. So this is our station and from here we can reach the bridge and Opera House over there. So now let's get out of the station. And as I told you now to go out, you need to stop again. And that's the ferry right here, waiting for us. Feels like entering in a huge ship. Oh, they have a bar. They have seats. So we're gonna take a look upstairs on the second level. It's quite full. So we took seats here in the bottom part because the seats are better than upstairs. And look, that's the view once the fair is leaving. And guys, look for this view. We have the gardens here that we visited. We have also the, the tower we visited also. Opera house in the middle. The bridge over there. That's so pretty. So we just arrived and this is the place where the ferry stops. So it's a ferry station. We have some restaurants, some ice cream machines, some place to eat. And we're gonna walk through the city outside. Okay, we made it to Manly. Yeah, Manly sign right in our back. So now we're gonna head over and just kind of explore the city a little bit and head to the beach. So that's the next spot to go to. So why we're here is happening this welcome to taste it on mainly. So guys, from what we understood, this is a, like a food festival. So you pay to enter, we believe you pay, and then you're gonna have these little tents over there where you can go and purchase food. So there's like many probably vendors, they bring their stuff here and then you keep trying one by one as much as you want, but of course you have to pay. And from far we saw the prices are not so affordable, it's not in our budget, let's say. So we're gonna keep walking and find something that we want to do. I'm searching for a hot chocolate by the way. And from here we have a better view about the festival, so if you see there is all these white stands and people just go and purchase what they want one by one. And right here on the right side, that's the beach! So we're gonna take a look at the beach, see how cold the water. That's our thing, always touch the water to see how cold it is and keep walking around. We made it to the beach! Yeah, can't you tell? Or... <laughs> <laughs> and now we're walking very slow in the sand and not to have sand in our feet inside the shoes. We're gonna get closer to the water to see how cold it is. Luckily, it's not a wind. 
it's cold, but it's sunny at the same time. So that's the beach. So now let's touch the water to see how cold it is. That's so cold. No? I don't know, of course. When I put my entire hand on my body, if I would do, I would feel cold. But it doesn't look so cold. Seems to be so, cold. so since we arrived here, there is of course not so much on the beach in a cold weather. We're gonna walk through the beach all the way until the rocks to see what's there, the other side of the beach. And might have another beach. We can see a little bit from here, but once we get closer, we'll show you guys again. <laughs> So we are here on this walk side from the ocean and we can go all the way through the end and make the curve to see what's there. So guys, we just crossed for the other bit side and here's all rocks. Even being just rocks, there's a bunch of people there in the rocks. But I think maybe they're here just for privacy because there's not so many people as there was over there. So we came all the way from there, walked all over here and arrived in here, there's a pool. That's so nice. And look at those houses. That's a dream house, no? So guys, finally found my hot chocolate, so let's try. I hope it's good because the last one I had was amazing, so let's give it a try. It's really, really hot. Fantastic. As good as the first one. Love it. Caio doesn't like hot chocolate. It's not that I don't like hot chocolate. It's most of the time it comes with milk. It's like it happens. Yeah, he's a free milk person. Free milk. We stopped over at Butter Boy. And we got a sample box of their cookies. Each cookie itself, which are a lot larger than these four, are about eight to nine dollars. But you can buy a sample four pack for 13 Australian dollars. So that's what we've done, uh, just so that we can try four different types of cookies. So, Kaya, gonna try the first one. What's the flavor? I don't know the exact flavors of each one because it is a sample box. They didn't yeah. say anything, but I'm assuming this is chocolate chip, just like traditional chocolate chip. They're very hard on the outside, but they're like super soft on the inside. I don't know if you can see that. It's kind of like gooey on the inside. I see why they call it Butter Boy. It's like a butter cookie with chocolate chip. Mmm. Mmm. Very sweet. Alright, next up is this cookie here. So, I'll put that up there. I believe it's a s'mores cookie. So, it looks like it's chocolate. Again, very gooey on the inside. And it looks like it has a uh, marshmallow very gooey, but then with the marshmallows, it's even more gooey. It's a very gooey, good cookie. Okay, and then this third cookie here is a Nutella filled cookie with a bit of salt on it. So it's like a chocolate chip cookie with Nutella on the inside. So give that a bite. A lot of Nutella. Can't go wrong. Super good. Okay, you have to try this one. All right, and our last and final cookie, it looks like it's a, uh, looks like Caramel, white chocolate, sea salt, and I think that's macadamia nuts on top. So maybe like a white macadamia with caramel on it. So we'll give it a big bite. I want to get this piece of white chocolate because I love white chocolate. Whoa, that one's really good. I don't know if you can hear like the caramel cracking in my mouth. Delicious. All four of these are absolutely delicious. Definitely recommend Butterboy when coming to Manly. So I think my favorite today was definitely this caramel with salts and macadamia. Absolutely delicious. And I liked how the caramel cracked when I ate it. So super good. Again, totally recommend. Also, like, real quick shout out to this box. Like, hello? <laughs> hello? Like, I think the price we paid was like a fourth of it went to this, these, this packaging. So props to them. They have a great product and the cutest little logo ever. Look at him. So yeah. Definitely try out Butter Boy when you come to Manly. So guys, we're just going back after a few hours here on the Manly. After a few hours here in Manly and hard boy for names. You guys are gonna get used to that. But we're gonna take the ferry again and go back to the 
city. City Harbor, back to City Harbor. Yeah, where we started this day today, okay? So we see you guys there. All right, we just got out of the ferry and we headed over to grab a cement and McDonald's. Cannot go wrong for McDonald's, no? Yeah. So it's also a great meal and a fair price. So here we are. All right, just finished up eating and now it's time to go back to the hotel as it's already getting dark out. Something that we've uh, gotten used to a little bit that it gets dark around five or six o'clock. So yes, uh, early nights here during the winter. So we will definitely have to come back for the summer so we can spend fuller days out and about in a little bit warmer weather too. Yes, for a bit today we are all done. I put my second uh, jacket that I have, but we are both feeling really cold and then we're gonna keep it here. Hope you guys enjoyed the video on the beach. Give us a like, subscribe to the channel and follow us on Instagram, don't forget. Guys, we're still on our way back to your home. We're gonna pass by the supermarket here, just get some cooks. They have these Nutella cooks that I bought once. They are super delicious. So, we're gonna get again. Let's find. We're gonna get some water also. 90 cents. That's the one we got last time. How much is? One Nine grand? Cents. Nine cents. So here are the cooks. Oh, six dollars. Was four dollars last time. Was it not six dollars the other day? Was four twenty last time I came. Do you want to go down the aisle and try to find them? Yeah, let me see if I find someone else. That's something that metal. I don't think I'm gonna get that cook because it's so expensive, six dollars. But the one that I love, that's Kinder as well. It's half price, so it's just a dollar, Australia dollar. So it's less than a dollar, less than American dollar. So it should be seven cents maybe. So I'm gonna get in fact this one. That's the one that I like most. And I'm gonna, since I can't touch a koala or hold a koala, I'm gonna eat one with <laughs> a Carmelo Car koala. I love Carmelos back home, so I'm hoping it's the same thing. Uh, I imagine it is because it's Cadbury, so only 50 cents. So I just found here also this chocolate called the Milk Bar that you would have in Brazil as well. And of course, they're gonna get it's just half a price as well, so $1.10. So I'm gonna get two of those. Guys, oh, oh. So here's what I'm getting. I'm getting two milk bars and I'm also gonna get two Kinder Buenos for myself. I also found this box of cooks. It's like butter cooks. And those are the ones that I believe is similar for the ones that they gave me when I bought hot chocolate or cough. They always put a little one on top. So I hope these are very close to what I got already. And that's my shopping for the day. Well, now really is the final of the video. We just make our grocery for goodies and water and chocolates. How much was? 10, 11, yeah, probably. Yeah, maybe between 10 and 11 dollars. Yeah. Okay, so now we close the video again and we see you guys next time. Bye.